Hello there, you're watching Dansky, the place to be to develop your creative skills and grow as a designer. In this tutorial, we're going to learn how to create a knockout text effect in Adobe Photoshop. So to start with, I've opened my image in Photoshop and we're going to be creating two additional layers. So we have a rectangle and we have our text. If you know how to create rectangles and text, feel free to skip this part. If you don't, then don't worry, we're going to cover that now. So just select a color of your choice from the color picker, select the rectangle tool and left click to draw a four sided shape. And you can also double click the shape in the layers panel and you can change the color if you like. Next, select the text tool, select another color of your choice. So let's go for black. Make sure that when you click now, you don't click inside the box of this rectangle that is selected because it will start typing the text inside the rectangle itself. So with the text tool selected, just make sure that you click anywhere else on the artboard, not on the shape. And then you can type your text, go to edit, free transform, and just hold shift to scale this up just dragging from the corner there and then you can position the text on top of your rectangle manually. So once you've done that, once you've got your shape and your text, what we're going to do is knock out this text from the yellow rectangle behind. And we do this by right clicking on the knockout text layer, selecting blending options, and you'll be presented with the default blending option screen. And we're going to set knockout from none down to shallow. Now you can select deep, however, it will knock out the text from the entire document. So that's a little bit much for us. Whereas selecting shallow will allow the text to be knocked out from the layer beneath it. So just bring down fill opacity from 100 now, all the way down to 0%. And you'll see that the text has successfully been knocked out. Now, if when you do this, you see transparency here instead of the image underneath, don't worry, that does sometimes happen. Just simply hold shift and select both the text and the rectangle layer, and then press command or control plus G to group these together. And then that should fix your issue. And now hopefully you should see the text knocked out of the shape. And what you can also do is sometimes it's quite a hassle to keep all these layers together within this group, especially in a large PSD. So you can simply right click on the group and select convert to smart object. And this will turn this into one single layer. So it's a little bit easier if you have hundreds of layers already. And if you want to edit the effect at all, just simply double click on the smart object icon in the layers panel and it will load this up as a temporary .psb file. And then you can make any changes you like. So you could increase the fill to 50%. So that's 50% of the black color that we started with. And then just simply save the document. So that's Command or Control S. And then close it down and it will update those changes on your document. So we went from this and then change the fill opacity to 50% of black. And it now looks like this. And there we go. That's how to create a knockout text effect in Adobe Photoshop. As always, guys, please feel free to leave any questions or comments below. Like this video if you enjoyed it. Take care and I'll see you next time.